no matter how action focused you are, we all have parts of our lives where we don't do anything. Everybody compares themselves to everyone else because we are all fearful and insecure. We are all terrified that people will know the real us, or if they knew the real us, they wouldn't like us. That's what I would rather help people crush or help figure out how to get around. We all put out into the world the greatest versions of ourselves. We judge you know, them living life on vacation against us living every day where we're struggling and we're challenged and we're worried and we're scared and all of those things. I have met very, very, very wealthy, successful people. But at the end of the day, when they sit down, they're just like everyone else. They have the same fears, they have the same insecurities, they're working through the same challenges. And so I think it's awesome to actually put out really good versions of yourself and really bad versions of yourself. I think for you, it just comes down to realizing the company that they have when you look and you're like, oh man, they have such an awesome brand. It doesn't mean behind the scenes that they're not falling apart or have terrible operations. You literally have no idea what's happening behind the walls. And I've seen it in too many companies where you want to work there and you go and work with them and you find out the culture's terrible. The people aren't good. They're not as fast as you thought. They're falling apart. They're on the verge of bankruptcy, whatever it is. I think some of the worst looking things are the places you're going to have the most fun. And if that's true in companies, that's true in people, that's true in brands, that's true everything. Not everything lives up. And so really it comes down to you deciding the type of life that you want to have. Don't put yourself out there and try to try to show the world that you're one thing that's not true. Be happy with what you have, own what you have. If you're not happy with it, get better. Getting just a comfy pair of clothes on and having a movie night with your kids isn't Instagram worthy. It's not flashy, it's average, it's ordinary, and it can be the most fun that you have on a Friday night. If you're looking to market without wasting a single dollar, check out this video. I think you'd like it a lot. And if you're looking for more sales and marketing tips, be sure to subscribe. Come on.